What's up, Deep Sea Divers? This is KJ48, and welcome back to my Subnautica Let's Play. This is episode 25, and today I have two projects I want to do. Um, first of all, I want to make a nuclear nuclear reactor, um, and the second thing I want to do is make an outside plant thingy-mabob. Um, and the reason I want to make an outside plant thingy-mabob, and the reason these two things are linked, is because for the nuclear reactor, <laughs> trying to really say that right, um, Anyway, for the for the nuclear reactor, I need um, what are those things called? These things right here. I need some creep vine seed clusters, and they grow on these on these uh, creep vine sample thingies, I think, or something. Um, these are rotten, by the way. Should I just throw those out? Do they do anything when they're rotten? Not really sure. Anyway, um, I'm gonna need to plant those. So what I want to make is actually I can just hold on to the stuff I have right now. Let's go on outside. And what we're going to make is a plant bed. Or, like, I forget what it's called. It's like an outside uh, plant bed or something. I have to get my uh, building tool. Um, I did put it away. I was doing some farming and I needed the extra room. So I will take this bad boy back. And that's a number three. That works for me. That rhymes. You know it does. So we're going to go out here and we're going to look for a nice place to maybe make some, some crops. Um, oh, I don't know. I guess any place is as good as the other. I mean, actually, there's creep vine pretty close to me. I probably didn't even need to do this, but whatever. It's part of the game. You know, I want to do some, uh, I want to do different things with the game. I just want to do the same stuff over and over. So I'm thinking maybe right in the middle, right? Maybe. Will that work? I don't know. Let's find out. All right. So what do we need for it? We need the exterior grow bed. Oh my goodness. It's huge. That's what she said. <laughs> Raffle. Um, yeah, that's not gonna... Oh, wait, it's not that huge anymore. What's up? What's up with that? That looks pretty small now. Should I make it? Eh, the hell with it. So what I was told is, and maybe I'm, maybe I'm mistaken, I could very well be mistaken, but what I was told was that you can... Do I have to get this from, like, the side, or... I'm not sure what's going on here. I think I should plant it somewhere else. Let's put it somewhere else, because I seem to be having some issues here. Um, so I, I'm pretty sure that someone told me with the exterior grow bed, you can, you can grow the creep vine clusters and get the, um, the seed, the seed thingies from them. Although I don't know that for sure. And um, when I was told, I was told like, I don't know, a while ago. So I could be wrong. But um, we're gonna see. We're gonna see. You can plant it over here. Can we put it down here. Yeah, we can. All right. This looks like a good spot, I guess. And now can we get in there? There we go. So let's go get some creep vines and put them in there. Um, yeah, it, they, they told me a while ago, so I'm, I'm hoping that this will work. Let me know in the comments if this will work. Although, by the time you guys see this video, I'll probably know, but... By the way, does it bother anybody else in this game that when you're, like, not swimming, like, when you're inside, like, a place like this, you can't sprint? Like, I keep holding down the uh, the sprint key, and it's not working. <laughs> so, I know you can't sprint. The only reason I hold it down is out of uh, out of habit. All right, let's take a few of these. Now, I did plant these inside my base um, in this tank right here, but it's not giving me the clusters, probably because it's too small of an area. So, I'm hoping that this will allow me to grow them. And, by the way, you guys did tell me that the uh, small fish tank... Uh, fish cannot reproduce in a small fish tank. Now, why fish can't have fish smexy time in a f in a small fish tank? I don't know, but they can't. So that kind of blows. I don't know what the point of a small fish tank is then. Probably just decoration, I guess. All right, let's put these in here. Are they gonna grow? Creep vine. They should grow. They should grow. Should we go get some more? Yeah, let's get some more. I think we have some more. There's no reason not to put them in there. Um. And then, uh, and then once they're growing, we're going to make everything we need for the reactor. Um, I think I have a spot for the reactor already. Uh, so I'm not, I'm not familiar with the reactor like at all. So anything I do with the reactor is going to be like a learning curve, but you know, how hard could it be? It's only a nuclear react, nuclear reactor. I mean, seriously, you know, plutonium goes in, power comes out. Piece of cake, right? I mean, if Homer Simpson can run a nuclear power plant, then I can. Although he doesn't do it well, but whatever, he gets the, he gets the job done. Um, yeah, all right. 
Alrighty then, here we go. There we go. Looking good. Looking good. Alright. Now we're going to need... What are we going to need for the reactor? Um, where is it? It's right here. Um, lubricant, lead, and... Oh, that's easy. That's easy. Titanium ingots. Oh, piece of cake. I'm still holding down the shift button, by the way, guys. It's not my fault. That's the way every game and creation's ever been made. I don't know why they didn't put Sprint in this. They probably, when they first made the game, didn't think that you'd be, like, ever inside a building, maybe. I don't know. Right, I think we need four of these clusters for the, the, the lubricant. Let's see. Yep. No, three. Okay. Never mind. And let's go ahead and make some titanium ingots. What did it say? Three or two? I don't remember. Uh, two or three, I don't remember. Two, okay. Um, I got a problem, though, like, uh, real quick uh, aside. Um, whenever my, uh, Seamoth comes up here, it doesn't repair it. It is supposed to repair the Seamoth, isn't it? The moon pool? I'm pretty sure it is. So, I'm probably bugged. What are you gonna do? Early access, right? Okay, let's come on here and get this stuff. Oh, yeah, I forgot I put another one of these down. I think I did that off camera. There you go, guys. I put another uh, another one of these down. And my power is actually starting to drain. I think they need to rework some of the ways the power in this game operates. By the way, these peeper fish last forever. Um, anyway, I think they need to uh, redo some of the way the power works in this game. And this is what I would do. I'm going to take a little, little sidestep here of what I was doing. And I'm going to explain to you the way I would do power in this game if I were them. I would take out the, the I think the, um, anytime you put down a power item, whether it's a, uh, you know, um, bioreactor or uh, solar, solar panels or whatever, I think that they count as batteries, which is kind of confusing because the, my max power in this base keeps going up and down. I'm wondering if it's because it's day or night, maybe the batteries in this, in the solar panels don't work or something. I'm not really sure why it's going up and down like that. But I don't like that idea at all. I think the solar panels, I don't think any of the items that pull in pull in power should have any kind of um, internal battery. I think what they should do is they should force us to make a battery station. Okay? Very simple. It's a battery station. You could, you could have it look just like... Here, you could have it look kind of like this thing on the Seamoth. Um, just like that. And have... And ha you know, like... You know what... You remember the... Um, Remember where the power cells go in the uh, the Cyclops? Make make those craftable, and then we can put them in our base. And then and then what you do is um, what you do is uh, right now what you have to do to power the Cyclops, as far as I understand, is make more power cells. You have to keep making power cells. Anytime you put a power cell in the Cyclops, um, you lose the power cell that was in it. Uh, and power cells are relatively cheap for what they are. I mean, they're not that expensive. But what I would do is I would make power cells way more expensive, but I would make them reusable. Or maybe maybe just have a, a third power cell that's a reusable power cell. And then what you do is you make those super expensive power cells, but once they're no good, you know, once they're out of juice, you take them out of your Cyclops or you take them out of your base um, thing or something, and then you put them in the charging station. Um, and then that's it. And then you just you rotate them and you, you keep recharging them. I think that's the way to go. Uh, because right now, I don't really like the way the... I mean, the way the power works in this game is getting better. They're making it better all the time. And I'll give them props for that. But uh, I think it could go even farther, personally. Okay, there we go. So, yeah, that's what I would do. I would make, like... I would take the um, internal storage of the of the power supplying items, like the, the solar panels. Take it out. And make a separate station that's that holds power and can recharge power cells. <clears throat> Maybe even batteries too. You know, uh, that would be. I think that would be really really cool. Okay, back to what we were doing. Um, oh yeah, we need titanium ingots. Uh, titanium ingots. I ain't counting them. <clears throat> I ain't got time to count. I'm like Jesse the Body Ventura, except instead of bleeding, it's counting. I ain't got time to count. Um, okay. So, what else do we need? I saw something else that was red. The lead. Okay, we have the lead, by the way. You remember I was getting all that lead when I was out and about in the world the past couple videos? And I was like, ah, oh, lead. What the hell am I going to do with lead? I don't need lead anymore. Well, shows what I know. 
All right, so we should have a power area all ready to go. Um, we just have to find it in this freaking maze. Um, actually, I don't have to find it. I know where it is. It's up here and to the left. No, <laughs> see, I didn't. I'm not as smart as I think I am. It's up here and to the left. Oh, let's fix that. Okay, it's not up here and to the left. I have no clue where it is. No, I, I have a clue. I just. Yeah. Okay, so here's that. So I was gonna make a whole line of, uh, of by, by the way, this these rotten uh, uh, potato things are just la lasting forever. So, man, biofuel is really good, but it's not as good as nuclear fuel. So let's go ahead, and actually let's put this at the back one. Put another bioreactor there if we have to. Nuclear. Um, let's turn it that way. All right, so I, I already have a piece of uranium, and then I have a piece of something else that's kind of like uranium uh, that I have to kind of mess around with. All right, nu nuclear reactor. Yeah, that makes sense. It's not nuke nuclear, nuclear, clear, new clear, nuclear. Huh, interesting. Anyway, um, okay. Let's go get our uranium and uh, pop it in there. Oh, look at our power now. It's up to 1,000. See, I, I like the fact that my power, my max power is up to 1,000 now. I think that's pretty cool. But at the same time, I hate the... I, the more I think about it, the more I hate the idea of the power sources acting as batteries. I want batteries to be separate. And uh, the game's still in alpha. They're working on it. They're working on it so much. This game's changing all the time. Developers are always making changes. Always making the game better. Um, and I know that they're going to make it even better than it is now. But that's just one of the things I would like to say. Alright, so I got a uranite crystal. So can I put that right in the, nu the nuclear reactor? I know I'm saying nuclear very slowly, but I'm just trying to remember to say it properly. Nuclear. Because like when I say it fast, it's nuclear. Yeah, I do say nuclear. Alright, well we're going to put the crystal in first and see if that... If that works... Also, I'm gonna have to put up signs in this place at some point. Like, I don't know why. I don't know what I'm waiting for, honestly. I think we could work on that today. I've actually got a lot of time left in this video. This didn't take nearly as long as I thought it was going to. All right, so let's put you in there. Nope. Oh, I probably can't even add. I can't add uranium either, can I? Oh, I gotta make some rods. Okay. I gotta get my rod out, you know what I'm saying? Gotta get my rod on. God, that's awful. Shut up, Cage. Jesus. All right, let's go. Let's go take care of business. Well, the one thing about walking back and forth is I'll remember where the damn room is. All right, resources, basic materials. I guess it's not a basic material. Advanced materials. Okay, I need crystals for that. But uranium is what I turn into the... Oh! Okay, so we actually need lead for this. Ooh. I don't have any more lead. Can you craft lead? Well, damn it. Arg. I'm going to double check and make sure I don't have any lead. Yeah, I know I don't have any. I'm pretty sure I used it all. Ah, that sucks. Well, I am going to pause the video now and we will go get some lead. Okay. So apparently lead drops in from limestone, but um, limestone can be found pretty much everywhere. So I'm not really convinced that I'm going to find that much lead, <clears throat> like higher up. So I'm going to go a little deeper. Whoa. So I'm going to go a little deeper um, down to look for the lead because... Uh, you know what? I wonder if I have any lead on the Cyclops. Oh, that's a good question. Crap, I should probably I should probably go towards the Cyclops. I didn't think of looking. Alright, so we gotta look for some lime, limestone rocks. Um, like I said, they, they said any limestone rocks, but I don't know. I don't remember. Like, I haven't seen a lot of lead till I went deep under. So, we'll, we'll look a little bit uh, here, but I think I might go like far under for lead. I don't think I'm gonna find a lot of lead here, but we'll give it a we'll give it a search and see. Uh, what do 
we go in. Okay. I don't think there's any on the Cyclops. I, I'm really curious, though. Honestly, you guys would probably know better than I would. Maybe I should head in the Cyclops. Maybe we should actually go to the Grand Reef. I'd really like to get this thing going, though, before I go to the Grand Reef. I'm going to need a lot of lead, but right... Actually, I don't even know how many lead I need. I, I don't remember. Crap. There's one, right? Damn, I don't remember. Shoot. Shoot, shoot, shoot. I'm going to go check the Cyclops. Booyah! Lead. Oh, I'm so glad I didn't have to go out and find this. <laughs> actually, let's take all the stuff out of here that we can. Honestly, I'm not even going to use these down here. Oh, look at this. I've even got more uranium. Ur Wait, what is that called? Urine. Uranite crystals. Urine. Yeah, uranite. That's what I'm thinking it's called. All right, cool. I'm so glad I got that. I mean, we're going to go back to the Grand Reef anyway, but I just didn't want to have to deal with it. Oh, and we actually haven't... Wait, is that the PC uranium I already had? I think it is. Anyway, um, yeah, so we don't have to go back to the Grand Reef right now. We're going to go back anyway. I just didn't want to go back this video. I wanted to, you know, fix this. Oh, by the way, apparently um, um, Juggernog is something from some game or something or show. I don't know. You guys told me, but I forgot. I'm sorry. All right, I don't care about that. Uh, this stuff, do I want to take this stuff? We're going to leave, we're going to leave the power cells. Uh, actually, you know what? This stuff can all pretty much stay here, I guess. It's fine. And this thing's a waste of freaking time. I can't believe they don't reproduce. I mean, oh, a big, big deal, a freaking fish tank. Who cares? Oh, these pop out when they're at zero, don't they? Oh, no, they don't. They're popping out. Is that a, is that, are they popping out? They kind of look like they're, hmm, I don't know. Maybe not. Anyway. Yeah, I like my power idea better. <laughs> Obviously. Uh, Alright, so let's uh, let's get back and uh, put some uranium in there and see what it does. It's in here. Oh yeah, this comes back up to the back of the ship. Okay. Very good, very good. Oh, there's the Seamoth. Can I get in from up here? Yeah, this is, this thing opens up. This is where the Seamoth goes into the, into the ocean. I'm glad they don't let you get in it from the bottom, or else that would have broken the illusion. Alright. Let's go power this base up. This thing's gonna be running on freaking nuclear power. What's up? See, I, this thing didn't get repaired. Oh, look at the things are growing. They don't look that big yet, though. I hope they get bigger than that. I'm thinking they might not, though. Maybe they just never grow big enough to get the, uh, the seed clusters I need. Or I'm probably doing it wrong. Wouldn't Welcome be the first time, it won't be the last. See, it sounds like it's repairing it, but it's not. Weird. Alright, let's go right here, and we can make some more uranium. Where did I find that those uranium things? Were those like at the bottom of the ocean, or were those when I was in the mushroom? Like, were those when I was when I was in that one part looking for the Grand Reef, or where they were and I was in the mushroom caves? I honestly don't remember. Um, what the hell did I come up here for? I don't remember. Nothing. I only have one piece of lead anyway, so that extra uranium doesn't do anything for me. All right, reactor rod. Oh man, I hope this thing lasts a long time. It should. I mean, isn't nuclear power very, like, efficient? Like, shouldn't it last for a really long time? I hope so. Honestly, these bioreactors are probably all I'll ever have needed. But that's okay. Nuclear power is really cool, too. Alright, let's look in here. Look at that. That rod's gonna go right in the middle, isn't it? There we go. Active. And look at that power going up now. Hells yeah. Why don't I see the rod in the middle though? I would like if they would tell you like how close these are to being used up as well. That would really help. But it's okay. Alright, getting some power. I'm probably going to put another... Uh, I don't know if I'm going to put a, nu a nuclear reactor in here. I'd probably put another nuclear reactor. Just gotta go looking for more uh, uranium, that's all. 
Probably not the best idea I've ever had to go looking for uranium, but it is what it is. Here we are, and that's what we need. Let's go ahead and grab some food. And let's have something to drink. And let's, um... Let's put the battery in our welder. Oh, look at that. Wait, do you get the battery back? Oh, well. I wonder if you get the battery back. Oh my god! You get the batteries back! Holy shoot! That's what I'm talking about! They need to do that with the power cells. I'll bet you they're going to. Now, how do I get power back in this battery? Is there a way to do that? Um, how would I get power back in that battery? If I can't get power back in the battery, that's not very useful. Hmm. Is there a way to do that, guys? I don't know. I think next video we're going to upgrade the Seamoth. Probably do some farming and upgrade the Seamoth. Um, and then I, I do want to go to the Grand Reef. I might go to the Grand Reef next video. I might upgrade the Seamoth. I'm not really sure. Or maybe a little bit of maybe a little bit of each. Oh man, how do I get ba power back in that battery? Oh man, that's so close to being excellent. That is so close to being the bomb. Holy cow, dude! Let me get power back in that battery, please. Oh, I can't wait. All right, guys, we are gonna call this video here. Um, next video, like I said, we're either gonna go to the Grand Reef or. If I have time to farm, I'll farm up a lot of resources and we'll upgrade the Seamoth and then go to the Grand Reef. If we go to the Grand Reef um, without the Seamoth upgrades, whatever, we'll do what we do. And if we if we upgrade the Seamoth first, we'll just have less time at the Grand Reef, but then the next video will, will, be, will be in there for even longer. Alright guys, um, that's going to be it for episode 25. I can't see my little notepad. I think it's 25. And we'll see you next time for episode 26. Till then, take it easy.